As soon as you step foot into New Zealand, you'll be surrounded with its natural beauty. And with a landscape like this, I'm ready for an adventure. All right. Traveling Losing the, the hat. Put that on I you. <laughs> It doesn't get much better than a long walk on the beach with a camel. Good to go. That's okay. No, no, you're fine. You're, you're winding it. All right, look at that. Hey, it's bigger than I thought it would be. Well, I might... think that's the biggest fish I've ever caught. You gotta be kidding me. All right, but well, what you, do we do with it you now? You won't be going hungry. I'm gonna put it in the cooler on the ice. Okay. So it stays nice and fresh. All right. And then we're gonna go back and see if we can get something and bigger. that's how it's done. There's no turning back now. I need to do it before I chicken out. Head, so oh, sure. then you like, look sure, more uh, more, more sure. as a professional. I'm gonna try to play a song. Yes. Okay. You can try to. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Welcome to our group, huh? Your best horse? No, no. <laughs> uh, by by best, I mean easy. <laughs> if you hit the horse, the horse will. Bite. She's gonna bite you. I'm so sorry, horse. Finally, I started to get the hang of it. Good. Just sit on it. Right now? Right now. How are we? Oh, really? <laughs> like this. I don't need a saddle? No, we have it, but if you want. <laughs> like this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Watch your head. <laughs> I pick up my feet. <laughs> when do you start to go? Okay. Whoa. All right. So far, so good. How do I turn around? Just turn. Yeah. I've ever been to. I mean, you can go shopping, enjoy some coconut juice, fried bananas, and of course, a cool hat. Oh, it doesn't get much better than that, except for the exhaust here and there. Like most places in Europe, I suggest you take a few uh, manual car driving lessons before you come because most of the cars here, if not all of them, are, oh, that was a good one, are stick shift. But hey, we're always looking for an adventure on a trip outside of the country, aren't we? So the Incas went from actually using clay to stack the rocks to build their homes yeah. to using, carving the stones in a way that they sort of fit like a puzzle to absolutely perfect square and rectangles. All puzzles, you can see here. And this was all just through time. They got better and improved. Exactly. We don't catch piranhas, we don't have lunch, remember? That. I know, we're gonna catch them, Wilson. Uh -huh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, is it in the boat? No, it's okay, up, no. you see how we do? Good job, Wilson. <laughs> it's like one bite, Wilson. We're gonna yes. have to catch hundred of these. <laughs> oh, that one, a big one. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Oh. Well done, the boat. Excellent. Well done. This is the biggest piranha that I have seen. And here we started with some olive oil. And then we went ahead and put all the shellfish that we saw here. And once we take the shellfish out because they're cooked, that's when we add the rice. So now I'm mixing the rice with the main ingredient of paella, which is called saffron, and that's what makes this rice turn yellow. We'll add the vegetables in here, which is one of the main ingredients, and then we'll top it off with these shellfish right here. We'll see how it tastes in the end, but it looks like it's gonna be a pretty messy thing to eat. Steve. Oh my gosh. Huh? 
by far the coolest thing I've ever done. Yes, of course. My uh, feet are. It might go a little bit faster with yes. if we start dancing. Let us hear some music so that you give your best. Yeah. <laughs>